Hello everybody, this is Seth Eiser. Welcome back to Crusader Kings 2 Jade Dragon alongside Thy Revolution. Well, I mean, here we are again. <laughs> I mean, we totally didn't just have a recording accident. What are you talking no, about? No, no, I don't know. No, it's been a month since you and I have sat down yeah. to play this. Okay, the actual story, since nothing might happen here. We recorded a part of... We were attempted to do part 11, and we got to the very end, and then there was just a glitch in my system. And I Unfortunate. Yeah. But let's make this part 11 even better than the last one was. Hopefully, some of the funner stuff we saw towards the end of that episode that happens. you all will never see. Unless he decides to release it as, like, an extra, which, I mean, that's up to him. I might, if, you know, what happens, like, doesn't happen. Yeah. I mean, weird stuff could also happen here. So you, who That's knows? true. You never know with this fucking game. This game, game is fucking random. This game will make you not happy. Yeah. So, Scotland seems pretty taken at this point. Yeah, it's split in half. They're trying to get Galloway. I don't like... Uh, that they think that they could just own this fucking land right in between what's going to be my ooh, two ooh, ooh, lands. Ooh. ooh. What, what happened? You should have a plan for murder. Oh, shit. That was fast. Okay, in the previous recording, it took about 15 minutes. This time, it only took one and a half, two. I've received word from my co-conspirator Earl Sebastian that the bowmen are in place and ready, ready, waiting for the right moment to strike. I count. All right, you know what? Let's go. Hopefully, it took about six, seven tries to do it in the last one. May Jesus forgive me. I don't like that. That's exactly what your dude said the first fucking time. <laughs> <laughs> and then Jesus forgave you by not letting it happen. Yeah. I mean, this is risky. This is fairly risky. Oh, to I, do. I'm going to do something for my wife. Oh. Because I'm a nice husband. Oh, you gave ah. her some money. Did I? Depraved manipulator. <laughs> Minus 10 for depraved manipulator. <laughs> That's awesome. I mean, you did chop a dude's face off. That is true. For no reason, my dad. I also may or may not have... Whoa! Whoa, 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 What the fuck? Oh, shit. All right. Well, this is already a lot more... Okay, so my guards failed to capture Godwin, who has now raised his flag in rebellion. He has... A lot of fucking people. Uh, 1,700 or so... You sh you have... I have said... Oh, fuck, that's... You well, have he money. also has allies. Do you not see these allies? Yeah. Here's the good news. You have money. Get some mercs. Oh, yeah, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I have not been... Ta I For the past six parts, I haven't paid... Ever since I paid back the Jews their debt, I haven't paid for anything. Yeah. So it's just been amassing. So, like, they want to go to war, but, like, I can afford... All of these people. <laughs> and this is going to get interesting. I would get some... Mer I paused it for you. Get some mercs and raise your troops. Hey, how many troops? 45,000. You have to also remember the weekly cost. Or monthly cost or whatever the fuck. Yep. So. The white company. It cost me about 400 gold. Holy shit, and it has a monthly charge of 30, so... Send this shit quick before I go into debt. Uh, well, you could... <laughs> here's what I... Here's what I... Okay, you can do that. Uh, I would have just gotten a Lithuanian ban, but that's okay. I think you're just gonna fight with mer those mercenaries then. Oh, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright, just let me know when to unpause, bud. Are you ready to go? Yes, I am. Okay. I murdered that person. 
Hey, you know what? <laughs> At least one th one threat down, another threat rises. <laughs> Your wife is technically rebelling against you. I just saw. Real hey, life. honey, honey, can you maybe talk to your insane, unjust brother? And <laughs> yeah, that would. Uh, I gotta seek treatment for illness again. Uh, become the king of England is my ambition and goal in life. I would like to. Ooh. Uh, a goat farted in my chambers again. Battle Chesterfield. The first battle in this war is a victory. Nope. Where's my wife? Second battle is a defeat. Yeah, you got their main stack just. King Edelbert of the third oh, of Kent. I Ken forgot your your tributaries are gonna come in and help you. That's awesome. Very glad to hear that. Why can't I pick my wife? Uh, she. She's leading the troops. To f no, the fuck, she's not. <laughs> is she leading the troops against me? Yeah. Sweetheart. <laughs> now, here's what you could do. I wouldn't really focus as much. Well, about... I would just go... I would just use your troops to just crush these fuckers. And then worry about sieging later. Oh, shit. I'm getting like, a lot of people saying, Hey, we're, we're here to fight. All right, yeah. All right, so just... I, uh... so use your power of mercenaries to get the advantage because now what the fuck's that um you have one less person what the fuck why what happened one less person <laughs> against you actually there's no longer participant in the war against the yeah okay right, that's good to know yeah I'm glad you people will join my wars okay Alright, we need to cut these people off at the helm. I did not expect this turn of events, though. Holy fuck. <laughs> Things are definitely different than uh, last time around. Hey, wait a minute. If this guy dies, don't I automatically win? Yeah, it would It would end. Now, I wonder if I, I can try to have that arranged. Hang on. I'm just trying to see if I can... Doesn't look like it. Son of a bitch. My dear friend, I fear the war might drag you away from me longer than necessary, and I... And thus I felt there must be something I could do, so please accept my help. Let us win this war together. Except. Bishop Wolfhelm. <laughs> hey, use that use that 5,000 stack and attack the 4,600. Uh... And then you can use your six, the other your other seven hundred and just ping pong those those motherfuckers and into submission. That's what I would do. All right, I think that gets rid of all the mercenaries. Oh, uh, you got rid of the mercenaries? Yeah, I don't need them anymore. Well, wait, maybe I do. Yeah, that might have been a mistake, dude. I think it was. But that's okay. It's fine. We're gonna be alright. <laughs> they were tossing me way too much. I couldn't hold that. Alright. I'm trying to see how much... How many troops... Plus, I have a lot of allies I can call in. Yeah, I would call them in, dude. You might need them. I must, I must try to spend time with my son. I love him. But fortunately, <laughs> at this very moment in time... Yeah. You might have to broker some sort of... white piece. Soon. Because this could get bad. Right now he won't have it. <laughs> Fair enough. This is interesting. 
Hmm. You know what's the most fun? I did this so I could give my wife what she wanted. And then... <laughs> And then she, she took up arms against me. That's 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 hilarious. That's what makes it funny. What a hour. <laughs> yeah. I mean, come on. <laughs> really? Yeah. Mm. That force is really fucking heavy. Oh my. Hmm. I have no... M oh, wait. I know what I can do. Oh, crap. My air has the flu. <laughs> this is going worse than it did the first time around. I know, right? Hey, at least the first time around, we didn't almost die instantly. Yeah, that's slightly problematic. Problem is, if you lose this war, I think it might be game over for you. It very well might be. And we might have to start over again. That's So, I'm gonna see what I can do. I don't know how much help I'm gonna be. But I'm gonna give it a whirl anyway. Guess I don't want the game to end, obviously. Yeah. Kinda went haywire. Yeah. Oh shit, I'm in a fight. Yeah. I... Uh... You're in some trouble, dude. I am. I might have really fucked up. <laughs> yeah, you... Just regroup with my 578 and see what could end up happening. Because we might have a chance if we band together here. I know what I, I can do one thing. Hmm? Borrow 300 from the Jews. And get another stack of mercs. A cheap set of mercs, I would assume. Yeah. Well, um, I mean, you know... I mean, here's what I would suggest. Get like Why are you the not uh, go. What are you fucking doing? Get like the Lithuanian band, which isn't too bad. I'm trying to send my troops over. I'm trying. Don't, don't attack yet. Don't attack yet. How are you doing? No, why do you get, why do you gotta go through enemy territory? The fucking... <laughs> yeah. Oh shit. I They're might just have to. the mercs. Well, you might as well just... Fuck you might it. as well might just go in. have them both go in. <laughs> and I'll do my best to... All right, let's do it. You're gonna have some steady reinforcements from me as well, so that's... We're... This is a fucking battleground. <laughs> yeah. Get that 1500 down there quick. Let's try to... Okay. I'm trying to game this system a little bit, I'm not gonna lie, but... <laughs> I think we might have a chance here. We are allies. <laughs> I did give you Winchester. <laughs> yeah, so I'm trying to repay the favor a little bit here. Come on, that 1500 stack. Get your ass over here. <laughs> Move. <laughs> Start jogging. There it is. There it is. They fucked up. <sighs> They're getting fucked up now. <laughs> I hope right. I fight. I hope my men fight him in battle. I hope he gets killed. All right. Now, here's what oh, I suggest. Oh God, they're, get, oh, they're getting broken. <laughs> now, here's what I suggest. Use your stack to pursue. 
pursue the mother broken. I'm gonna re I'm gonna retake over this part so it's not counting against you anymore. Where are they going? Wilshire? They are going to Wilshire. So How unfortunate. <laughs> Alright. Well, alrighty. I I'm gonna be pausing and unpausing like a motherfucker here, so Again. This got a lot more eventful than I thought it was going to. Holy fuck. Up, <laughs> uh, they're going now they're going to Middlesex. And I'm just gonna use my stack to uh I just realized I have like almost no commanders that are worth shit. Um Chancellor, you're just a fast soul, so here's that. They didn't make it out in time. They're not going to? Okay. And I would just continue to pursue them and just beat the shit out of them. <sighs> Wherever they go, you go and just beat the shit out of them. <laughs> I know it's redundant, but it's the best way to Oh no, that's, I completely understand. I did this plenty of times. Yeah, they, I, just they wish, I just wish I was strong in my bones to be on this battlefield. Alright, they're going to Oxford. Now they're going just... to re-engage, I guess. Oh, God, dude, we're nine years from 800. <laughs> I know, it's going to get worse. <laughs> this was the worst fucking time to get into a war. Like, fucking, what were you six episodes ago? I know. Alright. I'm working on breaking this up, so this uh. this will... And then I'll join you, and then my troops will join you back up, and... They're going... Oh yeah, I'm missing that kid again. <laughs> yeah, they're going to Bedford. Head over to Bedford and just whoop their ass. And I assume that that occupation score is gonna be, yeah, it's gonna be swinging your favor shortly, so that's good. At least that's the hope. I don't know go. how I did it, but I I just tempted to give him painted touch. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. All right, and then the last four percent or so. They're going back. To, they're ping-ponging between Bedford and Oxford. Oh, they're going to attack me! Um, um, <laughs> no, they, they thought twice about it. <laughs> yeah, they don't know what to do. And then soon enough, I'm going to be able to join you in the ping-pong fun. Hey, you got plenty of gold to hang on. Take care of this, so that's good. Yeah, that then wouldn't end up... Ending pretty good. Yeah. Okay, just gotta free up this last freaking. They're going to Bedford now. <laughs> They're just ping pong between Oxford and Bedford. <laughs> this might be a longer part, guys. Well, yeah, we might smack 45. <laughs> I hope you don't mind. Oh, he's in prison in force. Thank you. I offered you my demands. You have accepted. That's over. You can send these boys home. Every single one. My wife. I don't know what to talk about you. Uh, ransom. <laughs> oh, she's in prison too. Yeah, oh everyone, man. You got a long line of prisoners, probably. Let's see how many pr how many people have failed. Oh my god. <laughs> Praise be Satan, my black magic has borne fruit. News has <laughs> News has reached me of a groveling clown, Bishop 
Godwin's recent illness. He is suffering from slow fever, and I doubt he will last very long. And he's in the same imprisonment as all these other people. Yeah. Now, you can make a decision to, like, rant get your wife ransom out if you really forgive her. I don't. Or you can just... Sacrifice I do all this her. for her? You okay, so... Don't... Her and one of your kids takes over Oxford. So, Godwin... Hang on, uh, let's see... Commander. Pause for a second, that'd be great. Okay. That got eventful fast! That was, uh, that was, um... Why, why was he out on the fucking battlefield? Why is he so stupid? <laughs> I don't know why. It's he's like... The... He's older than I am! Anyway, so he does... He has slow fever now. That's just one check. Though my last act of worship has been some time ago, I could still sense... An inhuman touch within my soul whenever I think about what I did, I become a changed man. A tainted smell is but a small price to pay. I've gained deceitful. The prayers of Prince Bishop Swain have not gone unnoticed. Is there such a thing as a limit to my power? He's still a traitor. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna gather some ingredients. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna let these people in here. I'm gonna let them stew on it for a minute. <laughs> and then, are you gonna start sacrificing? <laughs> well, first, first, before before we start stewing on it. Oh. Satan wants a holy person, oh. and I can think of no better person. Than our dear slow fevered Bishop Godwin. Oh, and dear. as Bishop Godwin is bound to the altar, he appears to be mumbling prayers through his gag. He's sweating profusely, either due to the heat from the nearby pyres or from his fear. His holy vestments hang in tatters, already exposing his chest as the appointed hour draws near. The chanting of your brethren builds to a crescendo until finally it's time. Plunge my knife into his chest. Oh dear. Go? No one knows. <laughs> it would appear that I need to patch some things up. Oh. The remainder of this gold, so. You can you can hate me all you want. You don't really. You don't change. Anybody who hates me is fucking in prison, so. <laughs> That's true. I'm not too worried about it. Like, that this kid true. right here, he's not. Give him 17 gold, we'll slowly build him back in our favor. I mean, I am killing a lot of these people's families. <laughs> That's true. Very soon. <laughs> One of them is a hunchback. <sighs> well, you know. That poor bastard. I I did not see a complete and utter civil war happening. I I'm sorry, I did not predict that. I didn't see it coming either. I feel really betrayed, Seth. These bastards. They're bastards, dude. The corruption crept on me up, crept up on me so slowly I did not realize what was happening to me before it was too late. Now the dark tendrils of Satan's magic has invaded my body, zapping my energy and causing all sorts of aches and ailments. No matter how long I sleep, I never feel quite rested. Use of the dark magic has corrupted you. King Brahma Mercy gets magical corruption until February 22nd, three years from now. Negative 2 to Marshall, negative 2 to Entry, negative 25% to Fertility, and negative 1 to Health, negative 1 to Personal Combat Skill. That's not that bad. Wow. Okay. I just noticed you just got a giant, you got a plus 15 modifier toward me because I offered to join your war. You're a nice person. Yeah. We... I do not forget. Oh, thank you. Uh, that's enough for a ca that's enough for a castle town for me. Now, there are no known plots. I'm a nice man. I will ransom off the children. The children, because they really just. Earl Winston will give me 70 gold. You know what? That's fair for a child. 
there are some children I cannot uh ransom ransom why well I think it's just one at a time sometimes well no because I can ransom off other people's but say uh, my liege, may your humors rot in your living body. I accept pain. Excuse? Fuck me? <laughs> you have a positive opinion of me. Why do you ask, be such an asshole? You're only They're... ten. <laughs> uh, rebellious phase. Plus, remember, he's a hunchback. He's just angry at the world. He's just angry at the world. Yeah. That, that doesn't you kinda seem have right. To, you kind of have to forgive him for that. All right. How old is this kid? Ten. Thirteen. All right, seventy gold. As the cruel, <laughs> yeah, I, team cruel. You Whoa. you arose up against me. First of all, mm, an opportunity to strike at the foolish followers of the false gods has presented itself. Their priests and Russia are ignorant to the true state of the world. Tear down their idols, steal their wealth in the name of Satan. I agree. You know what? <laughs> I've been nice for too long. Oh my God. It's not, I, like, I'd be nice, I start releasing people, and they want my years to be short, which they're not gonna be, and miserable, which I promise you won't happen, just to pay me 70 gold to save your little brother. Oh, shit! Oh, I shit! I, I got corrupted by the magic. <laughs> oh, man, how am I the first one to go down in the two of us? Oh my god! It is now time. <sighs> and shit, you lost you lost a couple of counties because of your death. <sighs> I died of severe stress. I can do it. I'm gonna kill I, I wanna kill this kid. So you can get your stuff back. But. King Brom has given up, has given up the ghost at age 69. What a year for a <laughs> satanic person to give up the year. Oh my. He died of severe stress. Well known to prone in cardinal sins, he was often unfaithful to his wife. A wicked man, and I will surely pay for my sins in the afterlife. <laughs> I mean... Yeah. <laughs> okay, now you're at your second generation, and and look at it. I mean, his stats aren't as good, but look at uh, he seems like he's a much nicer person by his traits. Mm -hmm. Damn, because I was really starting to like where that was going. I was too. I'm kind of disappointed. Oh man, I wanted to see what would happen. Now I gotta be evil with this kid. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta be evil with this kid. Damn. Uh, long live King Drogon. Long live King Drogon. I think that's a good way to end it, actually, with that line. Long live King Drogon. Uh, so... I... I'm speechless. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so torn. <laughs> it's like, that's a great way to die, but it's also, like... Now I gotta be evil with him, because I really wanted to see where that Spawn of Satan story was gonna go. I know. He has to uh, get but... a sin first. He has to get a sin first. Yeah. yeah. Gonna be kin slaying. <laughs> Probably. Probably. I do have a shit ton of people in the dungeon. <laughs> that is true. Uh... Oh, man. Oh, I probably should stop the Audacity recording. Yeah. So, all right, I'm going to go. Guys, you've been you and a bit you do for now. Bye-bye.